magbuliga class maayong magbuliga sa kanan Good morning So, yung 112, ang original niya na applicant is 600 plus. So, very lucky kayo kasi ibig sabihin, you are the king of the craft. So, thank you so much sa board na nagbigay ng extra effort para masilip kayo ng maayos kung sino yung pinakamagaling talaga na dapat magiging fire observer. Ito yung produkto nang mula sa puso at para sakit na serbisyo ng ating men and women firefighters sa region din. I-maximize natin yung try skills dito para ma-maximize din natin yung pag-stay ninyo dito na may natutunan kayo, may bitbit kayong knowledge paglabas nyo dito after 45 days. Lahat na kagawin nyo dito is may purpose yan. Lahat na ipapagawa sa inyo is my purpose yan. Magiging prepared tayo paglabas na rin. Today's momentous event will not be feasible without his authority. A leader who leaves no one behind and rallies his men to perform to the highest standards in fulfilling our mandate Ang ato maman sa regional kabuhatan sa Bureau of Fire Protection. Let us welcome our Fire Director, Senior Superintendent, Carlos Steve Duenas, Sir. Leading Commander, you keep the kiss pain as a group. sa ating Honorable Gabriel Poy Sir? Uh, Municipal Administrator who represents sa atong pinakamahal na Mayor Anthony Oy na meron doon equal na uh, call doon sa government office sa provincial office no? Of course sa ating DRDO Superintendent Kabot sa ating CDS, Superintendent Bilio Ferti, sa ating Provincial File Director, Chief Inspector Miranda, dito si Chief Inspector Wakasnod. Of course, yung pinaka-active natin na taga magbuliga ko ay talaga na Chief Admin natin, si Senior Inspector Cariado. Nandito din yung uh, Chief Ipses natin sa CAFD, si Senior Inspector Apitan. Of course, nandito yung mga station commanders natin na gusto din manood sa reception. Sa ating mga tribal chieftains na nandyan sa likod kung saan ano na marikwa o ang tawag doon, pamuhat. Sa ating mga kasamahan, Pilo Firefighters, non-commissioned officers, non-uniform personnel, magbuliga, class, maayong magbuliga sa kanan. Good morning! ko lang ipaabot ang taos-pusong masasalamat sa pangalan ng BEP, sa pangalan ng aming Fire Director, uh, Director Jose Segundo Ilbang Jr. sa ating local government units sa Pasukong dahil na-realize itong 
training center natin na to dahil sa kanila. And of course, sa uh, aking mga staff na nagbuo sa Regional Placement and Selection Board, kung saan nag-select sa inyo, yung 112 ang um, original niya na applicant is 600 plus. So, very lucky kayo kasi ibig sabihin you are the king of the craft. So, mapapatunayan natin yan ngayon. No? So, thank you so much sa board na nagbigay ng extra effort para masilig kayo ng maayos kung sino yung pinakamagaling talaga na dapat magiging far of sir one. No? Of course, sa ating mga kasamahan na nandito, maraming salamat. Gusto ko lang i-appraise ang lahat kung sino mang hindi pa nakakaalam kung bakit ito nagiging regional training center ng BP-10. No? Nung tumating tayo sa Region 10, way back October 2019, as GRDA admin. So isa yan sa problema na nakikita natin. Uh, during that time, yung bagong recruits namin pwede pang ipasok sa mga substations during sa orientation. Kasi pwede pang dikit-dikit. Kaya lang, noong early 2020, doon na nang umbisa yung pandemic, di ba? So meron tayong recruit na 2020, nagka-problema na tayo doon kung saan tayo maghanap. Maghanap kung saan kayo pwedeng mag-i-conduct yung orientation. So isa yun sa problema na inabutan ko pagad. So, together with my staff, pinag-usapan namin to with the provincial fire directors, ang kay officers wala talaga tayong ibang option kundi ito na ang ipasubong kasi ito lang pinaka the best na training center na pwede natin gawin and dahil din sa pandemic wala tayong ibang option doon talaga tayo so thank you so much sa mga kasamahan natin ito yung produkto ng mula sa puso at malasakit na servisyo ng ating men and women firefighters sa region 10. Talapakan natin na. <laughs> dahil dito, dahil sa suporta ng LGO, hindi din tayo pinapabayaan. During sa umpisa dito, talagang nandito yung LGO. Nakaalalay sa atin. Yung basic na gamit natin, basic na pangailangan, Nandiyan si Mayor, nandiyan yung Ligio na nakasuporta sa atin. So, nakakataba ng puso talaga yung suporta ng local government unit dito sa Masuko. No? So, thank you so much, uh, Sir. Uh, sana matakot din kay Mayor. No? And, gusto ko lang i-appraise din ang lahat na yung development sa area na to is tuloy-tuloy na. Kung ano yung nakikita nyo dito, umpisa pa lang to lahat. Kasi itong nakikita nyo lahat dito, ito yung produkto sa bayanihan 1 and 2 ng ating mga firefighters. Walang, wala pang suporta ang nasinal nito. Walang budget na ibinbaraba o appropriation ang national headquarters natin. Pero mayroon tayong bagong development. Meron tayong additional na 2 million as promised by me. our fire chief. Nandiyan na. For bidding na. So we expect that 2 million na makakaroon tayo ng additional na dalawang building. So okay pa sa inyo yan? So ibig sabihin meron tayong magiging tatlong building dito plus makasource out pa tayo ng another funds na makakaroon pa tayo ng additional building for Miss Hall. So, yun ang magiging development this year. Gagawin natin yan. So, yun ang up, uh, update ng ating training center. So, now, as Fire Officer 1, 
na mag-orient or going to have a reception. Itong orientation, uh, parang i-appraise lang kayo kung ano yung Bureau 5. I-inject na sa inyo ha kung ano yung Bureau 5, ano yung basic na trabaho natin, ano yung basic na role natin sa community. Doon, ipasok natin lahat. At nagkausap lang kami ni Tony Carriedo, magiging i-maximize natin yung try skills na gagawin nyo dito. Kasi after nyo mag-UGT, after ng orientation na to, mag-UGT na kayo for one month. So, ibig sabihin, sasama na kayo sa firefighting or other activities kung ano yung mandate natin. So, i-maximize natin yung try skills dito para ma-maximize din natin yung pag-stay ninyo dito na may natutunan kayo, may bit-bit kayong knowledge paglabas nyo dito after 45 days. So, ganun lang. Be patient. You submit yourself. Kasi walang patatayin dito. Ha? Lahat na kagawin nyo dito is my purpose yan. Lahat na ipapagawa sa inyo is my purpose yan. Kasi kailangan natin yung ma-sustain kung ano yung pressures nyo dito na gagawin ng ating mga tactics. Ha? Kasi ang pressure kung nandoon na tayo sa labas masubra pa. Yung critics ng mga tao sa labas masubra pa. Mayroon pang additional na social media ngayon. So, kung hindi tayo sanay, kaya marami tayong mga trainings, hindi lang physical, mental, lahat, ibigay na natin para magiging prepared tayo paglabas na rin after this training. So, di ko na babain. Uh, last thing is endure pain. No? Gusto ko lang i-share to sa inyo itong quote. Uh, if you can learn to endure pain, you can survive anything. Once again, good morning. Reception rites is one of the many traditions that have been observed and practiced by the BFP and other uniform agencies. It is a symbolic heartwarming greeting and a festive celebration for the arrival of new breed of heroes. These traditions exist and function as their guide and basis for the building and developing their behavior, discipline, and character. BP-10 Regional Training Center, Poblacion, in Pasuong, Bukitnoy. Welcome to, to the Reception Rights of Recruit Orientation Program, 2021-01, Class Mabuliga. Requesting everyone to please stand for an invocation to be led by F.O. to Francis G. Talipan. And please remain standing for the mass singing of the National Anthem. Let us be continually aware of the constant presence of the Lord in our midst and in our daily lives. Let us pray. Loving Father, we praise and glorify your name. We thank you for the gift of life, for the calling to put our lives in the fire service, to serve that others may live. We humbly ask forgiveness for our sins and shortcomings. Please grant us the strength to endure the hardships encountered in this noble job. We pray for all our officers for protection from all dangers. We pray for our new recruits that they may be more open to be molded as new breed of heroes. We entrust everything to you, Lord, and in full confidence, rely on your grace. This we ask and give thanks in the name of Jesus, our Lord. Amen. 
mga kababayan, ang pambansang awit ng Pilipinas. To deliver his opening message, may we request Chief Inspector Romeo L. Miranda, the Provincial Director of Bukidon, BFP Unit, Sir. Sa ating pinagpipitagang Regional Director ng Bureau of Fire Protection, Region 10, Senior Superintendent Carlos Tenebro Duena, Sir. Sa ating uh, Deputy Regional Director for Operation, Superintendent Alan Paso Cabot, sir. To the Chief of Director of Staff, Superintendent Romel William Pilter, sir. Sa ating butihing Mayor ng Bayan ng Impasugong, represented by Mr. Ben Gabriel Oy, sir the administrator of this uh, municipality. Sa ating mga tactics, tactical officer na pinangungunahan ni Senior Inspector Well B. Carriedo at Senior Inspector Maria Angeline Ponya. Sa ating mga kasamahan sa BFP, sa mga kapwa, Kalingkod Bayan, isang magandang umaga sa ating lahat. Today, we will witness another significant event that will go down in the Bureau of Fire Protection Region 10 history. Dahil ito ang kaunahan recruit orientation program na mangyayari dito sa ating Bagong Regional Training Center or shall we say, the melting pot of the Northern Mindanao. Marami tayong aabangan mangyayari simula sa araw na ito. Para sa akin, excited na ako. Pero para sa inyong nandyan sa harapan, kakabahan na kayo. Biro lang, pinaparelax ko lang kayo kasi parang hindi na kayo humihinga dyan. To the newly observed Fire Officer 1 who have gone this far, let me congratulate you. You are very blessed and lucky to be included in the roster of uniformed personnel who is not only mandated to save lives and property, but also to raise the bar of government service in the spirit of true commitment to live up to our Bureau of Fire Protection mission and vision. This reception rights is a time of honor, traditions of the Bureau of Fire that signals your passage from the civilian life to a life of dedicated service to the Filipino citizens. As newbies, 
This will be your baptism of fire into the service. Moreover, today is a celebration as we welcome you all into the growing BFA Region 10 family. So, on behalf of the Bureau of Fire Protection Region 10 administrators and personnel, I welcome you all to the Recruit Orientation Program 2021-01 Class Magbuliga Reception Rights. Mabuhay ang BFP Region 10. Mabuhay tayong lahat. And now for the presentation of 113 fire trainees of Class Magbuliga, may we call in our Deputy Regional Director for Operations, Super Intendant Alan A. Cabot, sir. To our very own Regional Director, Senior Superintendent Carlos Delibre Vigna, sir. Our invited guest, Honorable Gabriel Oy, representing our very own Honorable Mayor Anthony Oy. Fellow officers and then officers, visitors, good morning. Senior Representative uh, Superintendent Carlos Duña Sir, well, allow me to present the 113 recruits composed of 94 male and 19 female for the Recruit Orientation Program 2021-01 of Class Maguliga, Magiting na Bumberong Lilingap at Gagabay, ready for the reception rights. Magbuliga Kue is a higaonan term which means magtinapagang kita. Magbuliga Kue is one of the flagship program of the ABLE administration under the leadership of Honorable Anthony A. Kue of the local government of Impasogon. Inherent to the Filipino culture and widely practiced by the people of Impasogon, Magbuliga Kue signifies solidarity helping one another hand in hand for sustainable development and lasting progress. At this juncture, may we request our regional director to do the honor for the turnover of fire trainees to tactical officer and that is to be received by SFO2 Gregorio Sabana. SFO3 Gregorio Sabana. Thank you. 